Now the method to solve tic tac toe problem is using magic square method. Here we are having a board in which elements must have to be assigned like this. Here we assign board position to vector elements 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We have to write these elements like this only. Here sum of all rows, all columns and all diagonals must be 15. If you will take this diagonal or you will take this diagonal 8 plus 5 plus 2, 4 plus 5 plus 6 sum must be 15. And if you will take rows like 8, 3, 4, 1, 5, 9, 6, 7, 2 sum must be 15. If you will take columns like 8, 1, 6, 3, 5, 7, 4, 9, 2 sum must be 15. So this is the magic square. Okay. So you have to assign board positions like this only. Here we will have two opponents. One opponent is human, one opponent is machine. They both try to win the game of tic-tac-toe. Okay, and to win the game, uh, either all one has to satisfy all rows, uh, one row, one row, or any column or any diagonal. I hope you know the basic of this. So, if one has satisfied one diagonal or one row, one row or one column then we will win so in this machine will work upon calculation and human will use his brain and both try to win against each other and both try to win the game so in this we will uh, make some moves suppose first move is taken by machine move one move one is taken by machine and in this move it is taking the position this position and in this position the vector element which is present is 5 so it will take the element 5 you can either take move 1 with human or move 1 with machine here in this case first move is taken by machine okay and alternate the alternate move must have to be taken by the opponent opponent of machine is human so move 2 must have to be taken by human now suppose human will take a position this position of the magic square and in this position the element is 8 so in move 2 he will select 8 element now the alternate move is again taken by machine in move 2, machine will take suppose 5 is already taken by it and it will say, suppose take this element 4 which is 4. Now in next move, next move is again taken by human alternatively. So move this is move 3, this is move 4. Okay, so move 4 is taken by human. So Firstly, human will check the chances of uh, machine to win. So, he, he find, found out that 5 and 4 are already taken by machine. 5 and 4. And if, if machine will take this position, machine will win. So, human will use his mind and he will block this, take this position. So, in this move, suppose human will take six, this 6 six ele six element, vector element as 6 and take this position so it has blocked the chance of machine to win now again as human has taken two positions already one position is eight one position is six one element is eight one element is six now after taking two elements machine will work upon calculation so as two elements are taken by human Machine will check that which element should human take now and which element it should take now. So in move 5, 4 moves are already done. 4th move is taken by human. So the alternate move which is 5th move must have to be taken by the machine. Now in 5th move, firstly as it has taken these 2 moves already, 
it will check out firstly its chance to win and if there is no chance of it to win the game then it will check its opponent which is human chance of win and it will block that move so see this firstly what it will do it will sum these two elements which is as it work upon calculation so 5 plus 4 is 9 and it have we have to subtract it with 15 to find out the place where the machine has to place its element to win so 15 minus 9 is 6 so see this this the element 6 is already taken by human and if machine has already taken 5 and 4 5 and 4 it needs element 6 but element 6 is already taken by human so there is no chance of machine to win so here we can write as not empty so it has already checked that it can't win now it will che check the opponent's chance of win so here we can write machine can't win now what it will do it will check the opponent's chances of win to check the opponent's chances of winning it will add these two elements these two vector elements that are taken by human in the moves so you have to add these two elements again and it is giving us 14 and you have to subtract it with 15 15 minus 14 is 1 so see this 15 minus 14 is 1 okay firstly you have to add this and the subtraction you have to subtract it with 15 okay so the element if one is but the element vector element one is not already taken by human then machine has to place its move element in that and machine in move 5 machine has to take this element see this 8 and 6 are already taken by human 8 and 6 are already taken by human and by performing some calculations machine has found out that to block the opponent chance of winning he has to take the element 1 so machine will take this element and 8 and 6 are already taken by human machine will take the this element after doing the calculation it has got that he has to take this element so what we have to write machine will not allow human to win the game so in move 5 what it will do it has already chosen 5 comma 4 earlier 5 comma 4 now it will choose 1 vector element 1 to block the human to win the game now again next move this move is completed move 5 is completed now the 6th move in 6th move what we have to do in 6th move a human has already taken two elements 8 comma 6 and uh, machine has taken this element 1 so now human can't win now suppose human used human take the element 3 this element okay human has taken so uh, the uh, move taken by human is completed now now again in move number 6 what machine will do firstly machine will check its chance to win the game so the elements that are already taken by the machine is 5 comma 4 comma 1 now it will take any two elements like this 5 comma 1 okay these two elements it will take it will add these two elements 5 plus 1 is 6 and the result it will subtract it with 15 so 15 minus 6 why i am using 15 because sum of all rows all columns and all diagonals must be 15 only then a um, a, any person can win either human will win or machine will win so 15 minus 6 is 9 so now it has found out that if 9 element is empty then it can win see this here human has taken 8 6 and 3 8 6 and 3 it has not taken 9 yet and uh, also machine has not taken 9 yet so now machine will take 9 see this 5 is already taken by machine 1 is already taken by machine and after working upon calculations it has found out that if it will take 9 it can win 5 and 1 
5 and 1 is taken and 9 it will take so it will make a combination 5 plus 1 plus 9 is 15 so now machine will win so here we can write as machine will uh, win after taking vector element 9 in move 6 ok so this like this you have to write 5 comma 4 comma 1 comma 9 so in this move it will take the element 9 and it will win so the what uh, here what uh, the thing that is not done by human is he has not used his mind he has to use his mind that 5 and 1 are already taken by machine earlier 5 and 1 in move 5 5 and 1 are already taken by machine and in move 6 it is taking the element 3 see this, this element it is not taking the element 9 so this is a mistake that human can do as human is not doing any calculation it has to just use his mind and sometimes he forgets to completely use his mind and he can uh, take any element so there is greater possibility of probability of machine to win the game of tic-tac-toe than human as machine will first check is chance to win and then it will check if it is not winning then it will check the opponent chances of winning and it will block that chance so here in this case machine is winning